Hi, welcome to Chris Cook for you too. Have I got a great recipe for you today. Okay, today we're going to be doing a medley. It's okra, corn, and tomatoes. Now, you may have had this if you're old school. I used to have it all the time. I love it. It's great if you want to just put a twist on it and throw some shrimp in there or throw something else in there. But these are really the basis for if you're making like an oxtail soup or you're making something else, these are the basis for it. But when I used to have it, when I was growing up, my mom just did the okra, the tomatoes, stewed tomatoes, and the corn, put it together, cooked it down. She added a little bit of sugar to hers, which I'm going to add to mine today. But that's optional, and this is real, real good as a side dish, and that's the way I'm going to be serving it. So the ingredients that you're going to need to make this dish is real simple. You're going to need okra, stewed or diced tomatoes, a can of corn, or you can use your fresh corn. You can use fresh tomatoes if you choose to use that as well. We're going to need a little bit of butter. And the sugar is really optional. You don't need it. I'm going to use it. If you like your vegetables to be a little bit sweet, then you can use it as well. So I'm going to open these cans up and meet you at the stove. This is quick, fast, easy, but yet very good. Be right back. Okay, now I'm at the stove and I'm melting some butter. This is like a fourth of a stick of butter, but you really don't have to wait for that to melt. You can just go ahead and put in your ingredients. And of course, my... Um, my okra was frozen because I had it in my freezer, so it'll just thaw itself out. In goes my tomatoes. Now, I showed you one can because if you're just feeding a small amount of people, you can use one can. But as you know, in my household, I have a large amount of people. Now, you don't want to dump the water out of any of your vegetables. You go ahead and use it because the water is going to help to signal when this is actually done. What do I mean by that? I mean that when all your water boiled out, all your juices boil out, it's done. So I'm going to go ahead and use two cans. Now when I post the recipe, I'm only going to post the recipe for one can of corn, one can of diced tomatoes, and uh, a small bag of okra. That's all I'm going to post it for. But if you want to increase or decrease, that's totally up to you and how well you like it or how many people are going to eat it. Drop me a little note in the comment and let me know if you're used to this. If you have had this before, if your mom served it or if it's something that you cook. Now, like I told you, I like mine to be done with a little bit of sweetness. So I'm going to add a little bit of sugar. Roughly about two tablespoons of sugar. And the only thing else I got to do is put the top on this and let it cook. I have this on the low heat because the rest of my dinner has to catch up with this. And as you can see, you see how much liquid is in it. When all the liquids boil down to just a small amount of liquids left to keep it from actually sticking that's when I'm going to go ahead and turn it off and the dish will be ready. Now, don't sell this short. This is a very good dish. I think that if you try it as a side dish, it's going to complement a whole lot of meals. You're really going to love it. And if you look at it, it looks like it's the basis for some oxtail soup or some kind of beef stew or something of that nature. So I'm going to tilt my top like I always do. Allow this to cook, and I'll bring you back when it's complete. Should be about 20 minutes. I'll be right back. Okay, now I'm back, and the medley is done. And see, see, I don't have that much juice left. You can take it down even a little bit lower if you want to. I don't think it's necessary to take it down any lower than this, because I think that this is just really going to be great. Okay, and this is going to be eaten with my dinner which my dinner is not ready yet, but I wanted to go ahead and just dish some up so you can see exactly what it looks like. Let me turn the stove off. Okay, there it is. Got a little bit on the side. That's okay. That is a corn, okra, and tomato medley. 
use it as a side with any dish. And today I'm going to be making a pork shoulder as well as having that. And I'm going to have some type of Spanish rice with it. So I think that this will complement your meal. Just wanted to bring you something that was quick and easy. And I know it's good. As always, thank you for watching. Chris Cook for you too. Bye. Please follow me on Instagram and Facebook at Chris Cook for YouTube. And don't forget to share this video. Bye.